How is it going my little arachnid spidey here bring you another YouTube video and today we're gonna be talking about roster mania I know you guys how I know how you feel about all my roster mania videos You're like oh J1 there's a bomb there's a bomb. I love your roster mania videos I know how you feel about them. I know I'm pretty proud of them. not gonna lie guys <laughs> All right, so let's kick off this roster mania video with rise nation and team caliber I this was a big bomb like big Bam! 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 Boom! 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 Brrr, brrr. Gunshots, bomb, nuclear attacks, Korean warfare, whatever you want to say is crazy. And in this episode, there's not many uh, team changes, roster changes, whatever you want to say. Not much roster media, but and season three starts today, by the way. Uh, pretty awesome. Maybe I'll talk about the um the matches in tomorrow's video or something. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. If you guys want that, you know, leave in the comments below. <laughs> or leave some likes or something. You know, I appreciate all the likes you guys give me. Not much, but I appreciate the little amount. You know, the little things count. You know what I mean? Alright, but like I was saying, Rise Nation, Team Caliber. So, to start it off, it was at like noon or something like that. Team, Gal Team Caliber drops the bomb saying... We have released Goonjar and TJ Halley. Now, if you guys remember, a couple days ago, probably like three days back, they just picked up TJ Halley. And I'm like, what? Wh what? Now, I haven't... I, the, they made a video on, like, their reasoning and stuff, why they dropped TJ. Um, and Goon, obviously. But um, the reason they dropped TJ... Well, and, the TJ and Goon is because they got first round in the, two, in the 2K and the 10K. I was like, What? You got a first rounded? Like, what if they got first round by like an AM team? I'm like, I mean, they could be Warriors, obviously, but still, I'm like, oh, oh, let me just back into the shadows here, boys. <laughs> so, yeah. TK drops Goon and Goon and TJ. Goon's been on Team Caliber since the very beginning. I think, uh, what was it? It was like UMG Atlanta 2012, the very first event. I think the, the roster was Sharp, Neslo, Theory, Goon correct if i'm correct that was the first roster i'm getting off track here guys but like i was saying kaching they dropped goon and tj um i think this was a really good roster change um now their new roster well before i say that uh rise nation ends up releasing neslo and theory and then neslo and theory go to team caliber now people are giving neslo a lot a lot of slack they're sitting here saying he's such a hypocrite i see why they're saying he's so hypocritical and like he's just like the biggest hypocrite in the world i understand that but he, he if you listen to his video like if you actually listen to it he, wa he just wants practice. He wants to win. The drive he has to win is actually really awesome. I I feel the same way, man. If I was at that caliber of a level that you're in, heh, you get that? You get that reference? Team caliber, caliber? Yeah, I, I think you guys do. But, um, you know, he's at like a pro level, and he wants to win. That's all. He doesn't want to come in second to Optic. He doesn't want to come in third to Optic. You know, he just doesn't want to lose to Optic anymore. He wants to put in the practice. He wants to put in the time. He has the dedication, the drive, everything. They're all moving to the team house, even Sharp. It's going to be Sharp, Nameless, Good. I mean, oh my goodness. It's going to be Sharp, Nameless, TJ. I can't speak, guys. It's going to be Sharp, Nameless, uh, Neslo and Theory. I'm sorry. I messed up two times there. Yeah. Um, uh, I actually think this was a really good roster change, by the way. Um, and then, you know, obviously, Rise is still looking for two there. And then they ended up picking up Goon and TJ. You know, the, it was like the, the like leftover scrap steak that you give to the do your dog. You know, if you ever have that fatty, just like, yeah, the, uh, the parts that's gross. Okay, you just throw it to your dog. That's what Goon and TJ are. Rise picks them up put them in their season three roster and now the roster is chino wheats goon tj um uh, i don't know how they're gonna perform they i don't know if rise has league matches today or not i know tk does tk plays denial the new denial is Hugh temp um replays and slasher uh we i i don't know we'll see how the new denial is and the tk is i think that's gonna be really cool that clashes it's uh you know two new kids I mean, the two new teams, you know, I, I think it's going to be really fun to watch. And definitely tune in to the league matches. I'm sharp streaming right now, and so is Nameless. And then, I don't know, like Temp or someone streaming on Denial. I'm not sure. But, um, like I said, there's not many roster changes. Um, let's see. Oh, TCM. TCM. All right, if you guys remember, they were looking for two. In my last roster video, I said they were looking for one. I had no idea that the, uh, Gunshi retired. I didn't even know he was on their roster. I thought he was on, like, Epsilon or something. 
but Gunshi retired, and and then they dropped Mad Cat, and I left them looking for two, and then today they picked up Aches and TP. About 30 minutes ago, they picked up Aches and TP. I'm just like, whoop the flipping do. Now their roster is Jerd Moose Aches and TP. I'm not sure about the European guys. I really didn't even know their roster. The only person I knew on that roster was Mad Cat, and he got dropped. So. I apologize if that is wrong. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep putting the tweets up there. I still have to go and grab the screenshots and stuff. Not many not many tweets I have to screenshot, so it shouldn't be too bad for me this time. But um, I just don't want you guys going on safari hunt. Like I said, safari hunts are kind of scary. You don't want to get eaten by a tiger, the Twitter e girls, the Twitter e boys. E boys are the scariest, man. They can just grab you with their belly button lint. It's pretty crazy. It really is. But, um, yeah, if you guys do enjoy the video, leave a like, subscribe, follow my social media, links will be in the description below. It's been Jalen, guys. Peace out, guys.